Hey, I'm seated here by the beach, and I've been reading a novel. It's called The Artificial Man by L.P. Davies. Take a look at that cover. <laughs> now here's a synopsis of the novel Madness or Reality in the year of the state 2016 but in beauty it's the year of our Lord 1966 now the book itself was written in 1965 uh, something is wrong monstrous and unnatural and Alan Frazier whoever he is or whatever he is finds himself right in the middle of it Karen Summer tries to help Alan discover the truth about what's happening but she sets off a chain of events more frightening and more horrible than anyone can imagine. Now I'm not going to get into the plot because the video will be extremely long and I'm only halfway through the book but I want to take you to one page and it's this page right here. It's referring to Karen the place had fallen silent and the time dragged. She found an unusual gap when her watch told her it was 10 o'clock. The time for the first of the state news video cast. Viewing of, watch, of which was compulsory. And there was no stereo screen to be switched on and no unsmiling newscaster to read out information from his three-dimensional tank so in this novel projecting ahead from the year 1966 to the year 2016 now remember the book was written in 1965 they are talking about compulsory compulsory news viewing now right now it's not compulsory but everybody's addicted to it so you don't have to make it compulsory <laughs> everybody thinks that whatever they turn on huh, on the television news is reality so the day may come when the state makes it compulsory and people have to report in and that's sort of going on right now but not with news viewing but with medical making it compulsory to check in so the day may come when people have to check in and prove that they have watched the state news broadcast so anyhow, this is a pretty interesting book. I'm not going to get into it with you, but um, The Artificial Man and Compulsory News Viewing in the year 2016, written in the year 1965, the novel. So I'd like to thank you for watching, and I would hope you can watch me I'm not compulsory viewing, but I hope that you desire to watch some of my videos. And I'd like to thank you for watching them, by the way, and for commenting. And I do wish you the best and the blessings of the Lord Jesus, who's the way, the truth, and the life. And His newscasts are always true, the Lord Jesus. And you can find those newscasts in guess where? That's right. You can find them in the Holy Bible. Thank you for watching.